how excited I am. I cannot express how excited I am for this hair. For this hair, y'all. This is, I have to read it. Um, this is the Brazilian Remy hair, Afro kinky, curly bulk human hair for braiding. And I got this hair from Queen Virgin Remy. And I have all these little plaits in my hair because I'm gonna be doing micro twists using this bulk hair, y'all. And the reviews on this hair on this website is really, really good. So I have super high hopes for this hair. I looked for this hair on Amazon. I looked all over the internet for this hair. And the company that had the best reviews and was pretty affordable is queen virgin remy hair they did sponsor three uh three of these package but i'm not sure if three packages are enough so i went ahead and bought three extra uh packs with my own money so this is half sponsored okay so the style that i'm going for is something like this let me show you i'm so excited i don't even understand oh my phone so I'm going for this kind of style right here. It has absolutely no scent. So that's really good. And um, yeah, let's let's get started. So what I'm gonna do, this is the back of the hair, yeah? I created small braids everywhere. Now with the packaging, they did send me a, what is this called, a hook? A crochet hook, as well as uh, these little fun, you know, these little thingies right here. However, because my braids are so small, I'm actually gonna use a smaller hook. So this is the hook that people normally use, but I'm gonna use this one, if you can see the difference, because it is much, much smaller. So it's gonna be easier to go through my hair, go through the braids without causing any tension. I'm so excited, I have to go to the gym today. I don't even feel like going to the gym because I just wanna do my hair. All right, so let's take this out so oh, i also left all of my edges out because <laughs> i can't play with these you know what i'm saying i can't i i don't have a lot of edges so i can't play with my edges like that i do not put any tension on it all right so let's pull some hair out okay Oh, and I got 14 inches, by the way. I didn't want it to be too long, but I also didn't want it to be too short. So I got 14 inches. I think this is enough. I'm going to just twist right here. Twist the center. Wrap it around my finger, which is why I also don't have any nails on because I can't have nails on for this hair. So I'm going to take my crochet hook and just... Damn, my edges look extra bald, but I promise you, they not that bald in real life. And I'm gonna take that and just go like that, hook it, and then pull it through like so. You see how um, smooth that was? And I really believe it's because I have a smaller hook, which is really good for small, tiny braids like this, micro twists like this. Then I'm going to pull one side. Mind you, this is just straight up loose hair. You know what I'm saying? Okay, then I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna braid. Just a little bit. And now I'm going to twist and I'm gonna use the this shine jam that I really like using when I'm doing twist or braids in my hair. Let's see if I wanna braid it. Mind you, this is my first time doing this, so we're doing this together. So this is not really a tutorial. I'm just <laughs> hoping that works out. Take the gem, apply the gem to where your hair is. So that way it um, stays really good with the extension hair. And then we're going to twist. I 
I also don't want to add too much extension here because I don't want it to be too much tension on these little tiny twists that I have on my hair. And we're going to leave the bottom loose and we're also going to add hot water at the end. So just twist that and this is kind of like what it's looking like. Just trust the process, okay? Just trust the process. This is the first one. I think it looks really good. My edges are just embarrassing, but I think it looks very natural. It looks like my real hair is braided. All right, so let's take another piece of hair. We're gonna twist it in the center. This hair is very soft, by the way. We're gonna braid it first, like we did the other one. So I like this one more than I like this one, but we'll see. Okay, so let's take this long piece right here, right? You're just gonna pull a little bit. And it's actually not this long, because when you pull it apart, it becomes shorter. This is about the actual length. Take our grease. Hopefully it works on this type of hair as well. And we're gonna add it to the ends of the hair. And on, synth on synthetic hair, it lets it get like this silky look with synthetic hair when you do this to synthetic hair. So I'm hoping it does it to this hair as well. Cause this is human bulk hair. I don't know how human it is. But that's what it says. So I don't know if it's going to work on this type of hair. I'm going to dip it in hot water. And then I will be back. And this is dipped in hot water. Shout out to Christina and my mom for helping me. Because I could have never dipped this short hair in the water. Look at how much body it has now. I am a different kind of in love. Like, I'm a different kind of in love with this hair. Look at that, look at the ends. Okay, now it's time to put on some makeup <laughs> and really give y'all the final result. You feel me? So, I'll be back. Now this is the final look, y'all. This is actually a couple of days later. The hair has completely dried. Y'all, you can see my gray hair. Ah, I'm so excited. Alone, 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 oh. I did a side part, a deep side part. It can get a little deeper. I can part my hair in any direction. This is normally my parting side. I can part it here too, but 
that's not my parting side this is my parting side so I can do a deep part like so and then a more natural parting and I really love this parting a middle part which is really not my favorite but it is pretty a nice middle part now one of the styles that i like to wear already is bringing this forward you create like a hump you bring it forward and it's going to stay in place and then you just pull it back into a ponytail and this is one style one nice professional style for work for going out with the girls you can put this behind your ear as well this is one style and then you take that same style and you bring the back of the hair up in a really messy bun you want to leave a lot of this hair out in the front make it into a really really messy bun and this is another style so how easy that was this is the bag if you need to push any twist in go ahead and do that so this is this style which is really one of my favorites Okay, so I love this hairstyle. It is so beautiful. The same hairstyle, you want to straighten out the bangs like so and just bring it all to the side very neatly. Go behind your ear and you can put it behind your ear and just leave it like that. Or you could bring it up and just like tuck it in y'all and it's ready and this is another style let's do another style leave the front out Leave some of the back out. You can leave the sides out. All of that. And then put this into a messy bun. And you'll have something like this. You know, you could do so many styles, y'all. Like the styles are endless i'm in love and of course if you don't want any bangs out then you can just bring it all up you can make it into like a looser ponytail bring it all up bun 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 you have a nice little ponytail like so it's i braided two cornrows back and i really really liked it And you don't want to do it too tight, right? Because this is a protective style. It's very light. I'm so 
mad because I thought I was recording. But this is another hairstyle, y'all. Like I said, the possibilities are absolutely endless. If I had some like silver or gold chains, I would wrap it in between these two braids. This is the back, y'all. It should have like a straight line going back. I hope it's straight. But this is it. Please let me know what you think of this hairstyle that I'm going to have in for at least two months or longer. I'm not sure, but I'm so in love with this hair. I literally can't get enough of it. It is the perfect gym hair. It is so... I literally... It's, it's extremely lightweight. It is a big difference from the Marley hair, from the other hair, the Cuban twist hair, because this is extremely light. It is so light, y'all. Yeah. I will have the link to this hair in the description box. Make sure you check it out. Big, big, big shout out to Queen Virgin Remy Hair for hooking your girl up with this hair. I'm completely in love, like...